Hi everyone. I'm gonna show you how to cut uh, alpha core tuna today. So I got two parts. The one is the back side, the dark skin, and one is a belly belly part. The white hair. So belly part has a people say you know, a total the very tasty part and more fatty. So I'm gonna start with the back side. It's less fat but more meaty. So I'm gonna just cut the skin off and uh, take the bone out. So these, these are frozen, it's easy to get scratch by hand, got to be really careful. This time I got a quarter cup uh, frozen tuna. So I can buy like whole tuna, but this is like quarter cut already and frozen. So it's easier to prep. And actually the price is not that much difference. So I got just take off the bone out. some blood. Bluefin tuna, we can eat blood, uh, but white, white tuna is uh, very uh, fishy, so I can, we cannot eat. Okay, so skin and bone is separated. So this is a flat of the tuna. Alright. And for the skin part, I can scrape to make some spicy tuna for later. Now, belly part is are more difficult to cut. So belly part has uh, these things. Okay. Out. So this part will be the toro, the berry, tuna berry. Maybe I can get like five to six pieces for the over. So now I separated toro and berry part. I take out the skin and the bone again. I usually prefer uh, backside for sashimi and belly part for sushi. The sushi uh, with the more fat will be tastier. Backside is just still okay, just my preference. Thank you. 
going up. So I gotta be careful with the scales. I don't want the fish scale in my mouth when I eat fish. It's very annoying. And so I take the both of bread out. These are frozen. Uh, it's actually easier to cut for me. I will show you some uh, uh, cutting salmon, whole salmon, next time. So albacore tuna, we simply have uh, two kinds. Uh, one is a uh, local uh, from BC. And the other one is a uh, Pacific uh, tuna. So local tuna uh, from BC is more tastier, much, way more tastier than uh, Pacific, the uh, Asian tuna. Yeah. I don't know why. Maybe the food is different. The ocean temperature will be different. But when you go to a Japanese restaurant and you can taste the uh, really tasty white tuna. That's a local tuna. And I don't know, maybe all you can eat stuff, you see that black uh, color changed, tasteless tuna, which is uh, probably Pacific tuna or Asian tuna. So I'm sure the if the tuna is really tasty, the restaurant, yeah, take care of uh, more their fish, for sure. Because it's a little bit uh, more expensive than Asian tuna. So now, to uh, toro, tuna berry part. There's so many bones here. like this pin uh, here. Okay. I'm gonna just take off the skin out. It's very, uh, it looks very easier when you look, but it took me like four years, five years to get this level. So, so you get clean, shiny, tasty color without any blood or bones. This part, the toro skin, I'm gonna make some baby toro from here. All right, this is uh, all about cutting tuna.
Next time, I will show you how to cut salmon. Alright, thank you so much for watching and see you next time.